Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're doing well. I have a bit of a chaotic video for you today because I am frantically trying to pack for my vacation. I am going to the Caribbean with my husband. It is a grown-ups only vacation. So in today's video, I will be packing everything that I am bringing and I'll be showing you some new stuff that I picked up recently. I just love packing videos. You know, when you're going on vacation, I just get so excited. I always watch packing videos, pack with me, what's in my carry on. <laughs> so I plan on doing a separate video for just like my toiletries and makeup because that is a whole complicated situation, but I'll show you how everything kind of comes together in this video. So all the bags I am bringing, I have here today and I have some new bags that I'm really excited about. I just love travel bags. <laughs> because it just means you're going somewhere, you know? Now, again, this is a tropical getaway, like beach vacation. We're just going to a resort, so we're not really doing sightseeing. I don't really plan on doing shopping, so I'm not anticipating bringing back, you know, a lot of stuff, souvenirs or whatever. So I don't plan on packing an extra bag. If I were going on some kind of a shopping trip, then I would pack usually an extra suitcase to bring back my spoils. So I have my large check-in roller base luggage. I love this bag. I did a review on the carry-on size, which I love and I have used a ton. And so this is the check-in because I am bringing my scuba snorkel gear. And so I need like a big bag to carry all that. So this will be checked. And then I got two new bags from Away Luggage. I've always been curious about the brand. So I bought the rose gold aluminum carry-on. This video is not sponsored by the way. I just really wanted to check out their their bags and so far I really like it. Now this trip will be the maiden voyage for the carry-on away roller, but I did also get the away weekender and I got this like, it's been a couple months I think and I've already used this like on road trips and weekend trips, but I haven't brought it on a plane yet. So I'm really excited. This is the away weekender carry-on bag and it's already fully packed. It's very heavy, but I'll show you what I bring on the plane with me. And it's very similar to, I did a uh, what's in my carry-on video last year with my Hermes grooming bag and it's very similar, you know, whatever, it's always the same. Okay, so I'm gonna start off with the bags that I'm bringing. So for my bag that I will be using like while I'm running around the island, I have this bag from Hammett LA. It is the Daniel Tote and I, I really like this guys. I've been using it a lot for like just errands at home. I've been wearing this when I bring my kids to soccer practice and, and karate. I love this slip pocket for my phone and it's small enough. Like I, you can wear it as a tote, but I always wear it with the crossbody strap and it's just so comfortable. The leather is super soft. I also like how the inside has this red interior and another little compartment. So this will be my just daily whatever bag when I am running around on vacation. And then I have a new bag to show you guys. I did a video recently with Farfetch and they have very generously offered a promo code and they did change it. So stay tuned by the way to my Instagram. It's at a heated mess. Anytime there's like a deal or a promo code or anything, I will share it with you in my Instagram stories. So the code now is 10 a heated mess and it gives you 10% off a lot of brands. There are some exclusions, but it includes this brand. So I actually just picked this up after that video went live. <laughs> But it's my first bag from Benedetta Brzecki's, I think is the name of it or how it's pronounced. I got this gorgeous, look at that sequin. I think it's Leviti Mignon. I don't know what it's called. The color is Dune. It's like this gorgeous pinky beige. Oh, so pretty. Look, it matches my nails. So this is like my dressy bag for when we are going out to dinner and on the island. <laughs> but isn't it so cute? Oh. I've been eyeing this brand for a while and I finally picked it up when I had my own promo code to use at Farfetch. So if you're interested in any of these brands, this is one of the included designers and you can still get it with my promo code on farfetch.com. And then the other bag I'm bringing is just the Longchamp Le Pliage expandable tote. This is my favorite tote bag to bring when I'm on vacation and especially when I am doing water activities. So I am a certified scuba diver. I do plan on snorkeling and scuba diving when I'm down there. I'm bringing my gear. I'm very excited. It has been a long time since I've gone scuba diving. And this is typically the bag I bring when I'm, you know, like you're on the boat and then you go for a dive because it's waterproof, it zips closed. And so yeah, I will be bringing this. And then for makeup and toiletries, I am bringing this case. This was gifted to me by Pixie Beauty. And I just love this little bag. I don't know if it's available for purchase, but there are a lot of similar style bags and I'm just gonna show you real quick the inside. It's a mess and I'm not done packing it up. 
but it opens up like this. Your toiletries are in here. And then there's another little zip pocket. I usually keep like hair ties in here. I'm gonna do a video showing how I pack this. I will be bringing a lot of products with me, a lot of sunscreen and you know, just skincare because we will be out in the sun and doing water sports and stuff. And then this bag, I have my LV, I think this is the toiletry 25. I got this for Christmas last year. And this is where I keep all my makeup and stuff. And so this I will probably keep in my carry on away roller and all my like designer stuff, stuff that I don't want to lose. And then all my other clothes and like my snorkel scuba gear will be in my check luggage. And then the other bag I'm bringing is my Fendi Skims pouch. This isn't available anymore, unfortunately. I added a little wristlet chain strap here from Dress Up Your Purse. And I actually keep my Dr. Dennis Gross LED face mask, face wear pro mask in here. It fits in here comfortably. I use this mask every single night. I have to fully charge it before I go. You know, you gotta keep your skincare routine going when you go on vacation. So it comes with its own pouch and then I keep that in here. Just another layer of protection when it's in the check bag. This is my Delium Tools brush case. I love this brush case. This was like so innovative, I think from this brand, but there are some dupes that are on Amazon that are also very affordable. This is great because it keeps all my brushes in here and then the case itself folds down so that all your brushes are standing up so that when you're doing your makeup, it can you can just kind of stick it in there and then you just have it on your vanity. It's not so cool. So I just have all my makeup brushes. I have a fan, all my like utensils and hardware when I'm doing my makeup. I'm also bringing the Dyson Airwrap in its travel case. I just have the Airwrap itself and then the two long barrels and then the round bristle brush. So I keep that all in here. You guys, I love the Airwrap. I didn't use it today, but <laughs> I really like it. For shoes, I have this pair of slides from Nisolo. And I just think that these are very comfortable. They look kind of like island vacation vibes. And these go really well with my purse that I'm bringing. I'm bringing just tons of neutral clothing. This is gonna be our first vacation in years. And so I'm just, I just wanna relax and not think about anything, right? Like not even think about fashion or accessories. I don't know, I, I know I say that, but I'm bringing all the stuff. Anyway, these slides are very comfortable and easy to match with a ton of outfits that I'm bringing. Another pair of shoes are the Dior Revolution sandals. I love these shoes so much. They are very comfortable. They have like a rubbery bottom. I have this in a few colors. This is the nude-ish camo option, but they come out with new stuff, like new versions of it every single season, I think. And what I like about this is that it's adjustable. So, you know, like when you're walking around and some, especially if you're walking around in a warm tropical location, your feet can swell. This adjusts depending on your feet. This is just another nice neutral option for shoes. And then for dressy shoes, I have my Jimmy Choo Bing Mules. There are some, you know, fancier restaurants that we will be eating at. I have a couple nicer outfits that I can wear with this. So I just have just one dressy option. And then a kind of dressy option, but more comfortable are these Steve Madden slides. These are, I think it's called the Brianna sandals. I got these last summer. I wore them in Miami and they were so comfortable, but dressy. I just really like these. These look really cute with a maxi dress and I don't know, just think they're so cute. I love that little bling. And it also goes kind of with the bag, depending on what I wear. Another pair of shoes I have are from Louis Vuitton. This was when I worked at LV. This was, I did a video talking about the employee sales that they would have. And so for shoes, we would get these for, I think it was like 85% off or even more. I don't know the name of it, but they are so cute. And yeah, this was when the multicolor collection was out and they had a bunch of shoes to go with it. So look how cute, little wedge shoes. And then the last pair of shoes I got <laughs> from LV recently. And actually my friend saw this and I was like, oh my gosh, those are really cute, but like ugly cute, you know, comfortable. Anyway, they're a pair of pool slides and it's this, I don't even know the name of them, but they are whatever pool slides. <laughs> Isn't that so funny? I don't know. They have this really thick rubber bottom. I have some neutral and black swim options. I plan on being in the water just like constantly, constantly in the water, in the pool, at the beach. I am just gonna be in the water 24 seven. So I have these pair of fancy little LV pool slides. And this is new this season. I forget what it's called, but yeah, I'll try to include it in the description. Okay, I need to speed it up because I have not even gotten to the clothes yet. But real quick, I wanted to show you, I love packing cubes. So I have these packing cubes from Base Travel, the same brand that makes these luggage. By the way, what I love about this luggage is it has this handle 
with a weight indicator here. When you lift it, if it is over 50 pounds, it turns red here. So you know that you're overweight, which is such a game changer and you're not doing last minute shuffling, you know, at the airport. So very excited. That's one of the reasons why I have this. So I have a black set of packing cubes. And what I like about base is that they have these labels. So you can label your clothes based on the day of the week or by category if you want. So I have tops and then bottoms. And this is pretty much the majority of my clothes. And then I have another one that I'll probably put all my swimwear in. And then the undergarment ones, I have my undies. <laughs> so I have all my undies and socks and then my bras and like workout gear I keep in here. By the way, this is my scuba gear, my snorkel gear. I have to bring my own fins because I have made the mistake of borrowing, you know, the resort or wherever you're going. And, and I just prefer to use my own gear. You don't have to obviously, but I just feel a lot more comfortable with my own stuff. So this bag, by the way, it's like this cheap Target brand. The fins that it, what were included are long gone, but I have my really nice Maris, I don't know how you pronounce it, Maris volo fins and mask in here i had to unearth this because it's been so long look it's turned a little bit yellow but it's still good and i just I can't wait to get in the water i have my dive book here and then i have my patty certification card that i keep in my travel wallet so this is where you record all your scuba dives now i have my clothes organized by category and the first chunk of clothing i have and it includes my airport outfit i probably will be wearing these viore harem pants these are my favorite joggers they're just so comfortable they feel like nothing i just love them i wear these all the time and then i have this crop top that i'm wearing with it so just a lot of workout clothes from viore this is called the studio onesie how cute is this studio onesie i love their workout clothes and then all my separates i have two bodysuits from skims i'll link the exact bodysuit but I love this one with a square neck. So I got it in black. I have it already in the nude and because they just go with everything, I think. I also did some last minute shopping from Veronica Beard. There is a Veronica Beard boutique near me. I've heard of the brand, but I've, I've never shopped with them before. So I went in and they were so nice and I loved so many of the things that I tried on. So I ended up getting this pair of like sailor shorts. Aren't they not so cute? They actually had a matching jacket with this, but I just got the shorts. I just think it is so flattering. This can be dressed up. It looks cute with a bodysuit or just any top. I got this in a size four. I tried the two and surprisingly the two fit me, but it was very fitted and very, very short in the back. So I ended up getting the four. So yeah, just basic neutral separates. And then also from Veronica Beard, I got this swimsuit. It is so cute. It has these little sailor buttons in the front. And you guys, I had white jeans on when I went into the store. So I tried the bathing suit. It was very flattering. It fit really well. And then I put my white jeans over it and it was so cute. Like this is a cute bodysuit. So I just thought, okay, I had to get this. <laughs> so I got this in the size medium. And by the way, Veronica Beard is available also on Farfetch and it's included in my promo code. So I'll link these below, but yeah, this bathing suit and then these little shorts. And then this set I tried on in my last few videos. I wore this in my Birkin unboxing video, but it's this set by Reformation. It's this organic cotton knit set. It is just so comfortable and I can use this, you know, on its own. I can wear the sweater when it gets chilly because you know, when you're going in and out and it's hot, but then it's super freezing inside and air conditioned. I just always like to have a sweater with me. So I'll be bringing this with me. I have this jumpsuit that I just got from Old Navy and it is so cute. It's almost like palazzo pants style, very wide leg, but then it has a belt to cinch it. And it looks like it's a linen material, but it's cotton and it just is so, so cute. And this could also be used like as a bathing suit cover up. And then I showed this in my Farfetch video, but this is the Zimmerman play suit. So it's long sleeve, it's silk, but it's, it's pretty short on me. This will look super cute with the Jimmy Choo Mules and my new Benedetta Bling Crystal Purse. And then I'm bringing this two-piece set that I got from Fendi Skims last year. It's like a scuba material. It's so nice. I've not worn this out yet because I just like haven't really gone anywhere where I needed to wear this, but I think this would be a perfect place to finally wear this. One more thing from Fendi Skims. I have the bodysuit. This is the high neck kind of shorty bodysuit. Guys, this is so cute. I mean, what a perfect place to wear this like this tropical orange color bring this for sure and then swimwear I'm bringing a ton of swimsuits 
<laughs> you guys. So here is the LV swimsuit that I showed recently. This is also cute because this also can be worn as a bodysuit. It's part of their flight collection, flight pattern. I don't know what it's called, but how cute. Really pretty gradient blue. And I love that it comes in this little pouch because this I can also use as a little organizer in my tote. Hermes does this also. This is an Hermes bathing suit from last year in this really pretty blue. It's just a plain one piece bathing suit, but I've worn this. I wore this last summer. It has Hermes kind of laser cut through the middle. You can't really see it, but it's super cute, very flattering. And then my Fendi one piece swimsuit. This is very logo mania, but it's so cute and just like sucks you in. I do have some two pieces here. So, but these are my little designer swimsuits. And then Fendi Skims launched a couple weeks ago and I bought so much stuff, you guys. And I'm so excited. I can't wait to wear it. So I have a few pieces I'll show you. So here's the Fendi one piece. This is the color almond. It's so pretty. And then what I loved about the Skims swim collection is they have separates and you can mix and match and coordinate and layer. So I have the one piece in the almond. I, I bought a ton in almond and then also cobalt. So here's the one piece. Here is the, the swim shorts that you can wear over it. And then I have a couple pieces from the bikini section, like the two pieces. This is the high waist bottom and then the bandeau top with a little strap. And then also with the top, you have the plunge neckline. They also had like a bikini neckline, but I just, you guys, I can't do bikinis anymore. <laughs> like, like string bikinis. And then my favorite part of the collection is the swim sarong. Like you have this long, high cut skirt that you can layer over the bathing suit. And it just is super, super cute. So I got this and I'll put the sizes below. This, I really needed a larger, like a either a small or medium, but I ended up getting the extra, extra small because everything else was sold out when I went to the website, but it's not too bad. It is very fitted, but I can kind of get away with it. It's very flattering and it kind of hits you, like sucks your waist in and then this part cinches. It's just it's so cute. And then the other color I got is cobalt, which is this gorgeous blue. I don't know what this is called, but <laughs> it's like the swimsuit cycle suit, I think it's called. So it's got shorts. And then it has just this and then the racer back. Again, I will be doing water sports, like water activities. We're gonna be going on a boat, going on a, what is it, a hobby cat. I'm gonna be scuba diving, I'm gonna be snorkeling. With scuba diving, you have to wear a wetsuit anyway. So I usually you know, wanna be a little more covered up. So I have this and I just think it's so cute. And then I have the long sleeve, like it's almost like a rash guard because I am all about sun care and sun protection. So I like to cover up when I can and put this on when you're like in the sun. So that is everything I am bringing with me on this vacation. I cannot wait. I will try to include some like actual packing videos, like point of view. I really like to see exactly how people pack their luggage sometimes. So, <laughs> oh, and I didn't even get to my carry on. So I might have to do this in an entirely separate video. Okay, so I think I'm pretty much packed here. So on the left, I have all of my clothes you know, dressy stuff, separates, undies, swimwear, that's all in these packing cubes. And actually I can keep this tote here. And then this is the purse that we'll be bringing. So then this zips up. And then on the right side here, I have my scuba snorkel gear. I have my toiletries, like my liquid toiletries I keep in that little pixie case. My Fendi Skims wristlet pouch with the Dr. Dennis Gross face mask. I have the my little blingy Steve Madden sandals in here, my brushes. Oh, and then I have these peach bands. These are my favorite workout bands. I always bring this when I travel so that I can still get a band workout in. It has a bunch in here. Just goes in here. This is the my Dyson Airwrap travel bag. And then my new solo slides. So this all fits in here very nicely. And then this flattens it. And I can close it up. So this is what I will be checking. And then over here in my away carry-on, these are all my more expensive things that I don't want to keep close to me. So on the left side, my Jimmy Choo Mules, my Benedetta bag, my LV slides, my Dior slides. What is this? Oh, my LV wedges. And then this closes up. I'm going to do a whole review video on, the, on this away luggage. I really like it. 
I think it's so cool. I like how this hooks on so you don't have to deal with snaps. Also the closure, it doesn't have a zipper. It's this like, I'll show you how it works, but you push this and then it just hooks. So you don't have to deal with zipping it around. It's like, I never realized how much I hated zipping it around. <laughs> so this way you just push it and the latches open up. And then over here you have this little other compression thing. It opens up. So here I have my makeup. This I want to carry with me because I don't want to, you know, I don't want the stuff to break, like all the powders and eyeshadows and face powders and stuff. And then I have my LV swimsuit. And then I think I might be bringing this. I'm not sure. I'm still kind of playing around with what I'm packing, but if I do bring it, it will be in this roller. And then my Hermes and Fendi swimsuits. And then I didn't show you guys, but I got these air tags. And I'm so excited because I cannot wait. This is my first like international travel in a long time. So I have these air tags. I got a set of four and I put one in each luggage. So even though this is a carry on, just in case I have my away rose gold. So it's labeled, it's connected to my phone. I just keep it here in this little pocket. And then I have the other air tag in here, base large roller. And that's what I have it labeled as in my phone. So I can always track it just in case. No, you never know. I might use a bag. So that is, so that's pretty much everything that I am packing for my trip. Let me know if you're going on vacation. I just can't wait. We need to get out of the house. It's spring break. It's summer vacation coming up. I can't wait. Where are you guys going? Let's get away and spend time with our family and loved ones. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching and I will catch you in my next video. Bye.